this is it. You're sorely mistaken. Get it back One in blood, then, another. bitch. I'll Get it back sure in blood. You pay for this. We've been writing for it. You say this and you say that, but all I hear is chit chat. Come on. Barely hesitates oh! before raising her arm with her mouth. Oh her teeth my tearing God. through her with a deter This is another trick. You're trying to sow doubt, but it's not going to work on me. Never trust these women, fam. I should have known, man. Back to the box. Because you'll always want to know what it means to be you. I will be here waiting by your side until you're ready to return to mine. What do you mean? Yo. She crashed my game. Cold days, blown with a stone face. Rose drip to the bone and going his own way. Loaded on the trip to the cold and it's gone. And back at it again with Slater Princess, man. Oh, we had a, bro, we got a horrible ending last time, bro. All right, you know what? It just made me forget, She though. asks that I tell you, you to got remember it. her. Remember who? The, that better not be the prisoner. I was trying you to talk to her the whole time. Am I permanently dead? What? Just, what? Oh my. So I wanted to try it again, bro. There's so many endings, too. There's like a thousand some choices you can go in, a thousand different paths. I feel like the one I made, I don't even know what I was doing. I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna cap, fam. Like, oh my god, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not gonna lie, I'm killing her this time, though. I'm not getting manipulated. But let's lock right into it, bro. We're gonna go new game, no cap. Chapter one, the hero and the princess, you know what I'm saying? You're on a path in the woods, and at the end of that path is a cabin. You're here to slay her. I'm talking about the end of Good everything in, as we know it. No more birds, no more trees, and perhaps most problematically of all, no more people. You have to put an end to her. I still think the narrator is bad, though. I'm not going to lie, but we're going to lock in. But how can a princess locked away in the basement in the world? If you don't tell me why she's dangerous, I'm not going to kill her. That might be the most realistic answer on here. I'm not going to lie. Do you have any evidence to back this up? Have you considered that maybe the only reason she's going to end the world is because she's locked up? That's a W. Killing a princess seemed kind of, ba kind of bad though, doesn't it? Can't someone else do it? That's lazy as hell, fam. Um, if you don't tell me she's how, not I'm not gonna kill her, fam. She's just a princess. The danger comes if she gets out, which she will unless you do something about it. Okay, what happens if she gets out then? I want specifics. Let's get right down to the nitty gritty then. Sherlock Holmes and his 22nd century. You feel me? Do you have any evidence to back this up? Have you considered that maybe the only reason she's going to end the world is because she's locked up? Killing a princess seems kind of bad though. Can't someone else do this? Forget this. I'm not doing this. Have you considered that maybe I'm okay with the world ending? That's a me I answer haven't. as well. Why would I'm I gonna even consider be. that? Nobody wants the world to end. Cap, I'm not gonna lie, the world would be better if it ended. I mean, maybe some people do. Nihilists, or very, very evil people, but surely you're not one Dang, of those. Dang, am I evil, chat? Right? God, I am one of those. I ain't gonna lie to you, buddy. Okay. What happens if she gets out then? I want specific. Let's get down to the nitty gritty, bro. We need to know as much information as possible. Bro. The more specifics you have, the harder it will be for you to do this very important job. She's a princess. People will listen to her because listening to her is in their nature. And when they do, everything will come crashing down. What is twin yapping about? I'm not gonna lie. Have you considered that maybe the only reason she is going to end the world is because she's locked up. While I down. appreciate the mental exercise, we are running up against a bit of a ticking clock. Are we really though, bro? Like, Nevertheless, let me assure you, she ain't the doing princess that, but is locked up right because in the basement. she is dangerous. She is not dangerous because she's locked up. 
I want to see how dangerous she is. Before you decide to waste even more of our time by asking how I know that, let me suggest a more pragmatic lens through which to view this situation. Causality doesn't matter here, because the end result is the same no matter what led us up to this point. If the princess leaves Why bro, the character, trying to get deep the world with me, man. will end, and there is no changing that. You can't manipulate a manipulator, twin. It's no use arguing semantics over a metaphorical chicken or egg, because the egg is hatched and it's about to ruin everything. Unless, of course, you do your job and slay her. I still don't trust the narrator either, bro. He pushing me killing her bad as hey for no reason. Even though she is Loki a demon whore, but that's neither here or there. Look, I'll go to the cabin and I'll talk to her. And if she is bad as you say, then maybe I'll slay her. But I'm not committing to anything until I have a chance to meet her face to face. Then I guess Real we'll just have to see what happens. But a word of warning. If you go in prepared to hear her out, she could easily trap you in her web of lies. And the more you listen to her honeyed words, the harder it'll be to pull yourself out. Then each and every one of us is doomed. How are we doomed? So sure. Go not telling me. Her. See how that turns out for all of us. I will talk to her. You make I will. your way up the short path to the cabin. You'll find the princess within. We're not going to go through with this, right? She's a princess. We're supposed to save princesses. I'm not, not gonna lie. I haven't him. tried going in there without the knife, Ignore though. Him. He doesn't what if she don't spaz about. out on me without the knife? You feel me? Hold on. That could be an option, chat. Let's lock in with that one. Hold on. I might have could, because she won't see me as I'm like going in there as a threat to be even begin with. The interior of the cabin is almost entirely bare. The air is stale and musty, and the floor and walls are painted in a fine layer of dust. The only furniture of note is a plain wooden table. Perched on that table is a pristine blade. The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you want to do this right. Nah, I'm not gonna do it. Come on now. Why is it still taking screenshots? The door to the basement creaks open, revealing a staircase faintly illuminated by an unseen light in the room below. This is an oppressive place. The air feels heavy and damp, a hint of rot filtering from the ancient wood. If the princess really lives here, slaying her is probably doing her a favor. Her voice softly carries up the stairs. Hello? Is someone there? This hypnotizing. Yeah, it's are the you kind here? Of voice you only have to hear once <laughs> to remember it for the rest of your life. <laughs> she got that. Mm hmm. You hear me? I don't think y'all hear me. Don't let it fool you. It's all part of the manipulation. You're playing a dangerous game by Nah, she is a manipulator, though, and I'm not getting manipulated this time. A lie. I'm here to save you. Hey, I think I'm here to slay. <laughs> this is crazy. Uh, I'm gonna just continue down the stairs. Why am I gonna to talk to her? It would be better if you had a weapon, but you may still be able to do what needs to be done. <laughs> I can do it with my bare hands. You walk down the stairs and yeah, look at the one. princess. There's a heavy chain around her wrist, binding her to the far wall of the basement. She's beautiful. How could someone like this be a threat to anyone? She is bad, though. Let's be real. I am Fiona. You to stay focused. There's Shout out to my track nimbus. Oh! Hi. Do you think you can get me out of these chains? I could try. I see what I can do. You're only making this more difficult. Narrator, get out of my head. Thank you. Thank you. You're making a huge mistake. Yo, chill out, uh, Gango. You're doing the right thing. You walk up to the chains binding the princess to the wall and give them a tug. They're large and heavy, far too solid for you to even imagine trying to break them apart. I'm guessing you don't have the key? Maybe it's No, I don't have the key, fam. Doubtful. Whoever locked the princess away down here intended for her to never see the light of day. They wouldn't have just 
left the key to her chains somewhere in the cabin. Or would they? Hmm. Narrator, I see what you're trying to do here. And it's not working on me. And if there's any... And if there isn't any key, do you have any other ideas? That's a good question to ask. I'm going upstairs to check. Maybe there's a key still lying around somewhere up there. And if not, maybe I can at least find something to break your feet. That's a good answer. But we're going to ask what are the other maybe options Maybe there's some first. way to break the chains. Look at those eyes, bro. Like, this is a manipulator, bro. These are the women you want to stay away from. Oh, God. Or if Talk that to me. Work, I guess we can always cut me out of them. What do you mean, cut you out? Like, she offers the suggestion with almost complete nonchalance. If we were stuck down here long enough, I'm sure we'd be nonchalant about cutting our way out if it meant we could finally be free. She wants us to slit her wrist, bro. You attempt to make your way out of the basement. The narrator from the door trap at the top me, of man. the stairs slams shut. Come on, you we know this. A lock sliding into place. Is someone else here? Hey, let me out of here. Try the door. Let's try, try the, door. the door. But it's locked from the outside. Of course it is, narrator. Your shouts and pleas are met with silence. At least answer the nibble. You're here to slay the princess, and you won't leave until the task is done. Twin hacking the game, bro. You make Come your on. way to the bottom of the stairs. This would have been so much easier if you'd just taken the blade like you were supposed to. Dang, now how am I supposed to cut her out of here? Easier for whom? Easier for everyone. Look at the mess you're in. Bro, I think this is through the W, bro. Not coming down here with a weapon, man. I heard the door slam. They locked you down here too, didn't they? There's a slight panic rising in the princess's voice. If I could just get out of these chains, I know we could force our way out of here together. Yes. She barely hesitates oh. before raising her arm to her mouth, oh her teeth tearing God. through her name with the determination of the oh trap. Oh my God! What is this game? Oh, not, I did not expect, what? So. As she rips her flesh from her bones, oh. a sound oh. comes from behind you, the clang of bouncing metal. It's the blade from upstairs. You're not sure how it made its way down here, but it's yeah, right. So you just launched the freaking blade at me, bro? Or we could use it to free her. You won't like what happens if you do that. I'm not gonna lie. Dang it, I, I did save her last time, chat. So we do have to slay her this time, fam. Without hesitation, bring the blade down and plunge it into the princess's back. Oh my God. The wound drives her to the ground. Stab her again. Okay. There's no going back now. I'm with you to the end. W hero. You bastard. Were you lying to me this whole you time? You got manipulated. Talk to me. The princess pushes away from oh, you. The motion ripping the blade from I don't from her like back. these. She's going to murder me. I'm dead. GG's. Wounded, but still alive, she crouches on all fours in the corner I don't know why you didn't stab her most your times. eyes with the ferocity of a cornered predator. You've made a terrible enemy, and there's nothing in the world that can possibly save you from me. Cap. Nigga, cap. Do something about it. I'm gonna stab the shit out you. I thought we had the upper hand, but... Oh, God, you need to know. She's barely even threatened by us. It's an act. She's wounded and unarmed. There's nothing she can do to hurt you. The narrator, you're capped though. You better get me murdered, because I know she can do some weird, freaky stuff, bro. And you sitting here capping to me. I you trying to get me killed. Her. He lied to me. As you ready oh. your blade to deliver a lethal blow, she lunges at your legs with the same animal ferocity she used to tear at her arm. Your knife cuts into her again and again as you're tackled to the ground. Oh my god, look at the teeth! This is not a normal woman, man! Claw. Come on now! Forget about she trying to rescue to her. Die. This is my about I love all women. Give her everything you've got. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> Though your nerves are seizing with pain, you know you've done your fair you better dug out, bro. Well. We ain't coming all this far to quit now. The we finishing the job! You seize a moment of hesitation to throw her off of you and shakily push yourself back to your knees. We can still turn this around. 
What do you mean? We can still turn this around. Run for the stairs and lock her in the basement. Maybe she'll bleed out. What would that do? I look you want to try that up just for shits and giggles. I'm not going to lie. Because finish the job and give up are too crazy. Like, I give up, she's going to murderize me. And I finish the job. I don't even know if I can kill her for real. Or if I run and lock for the basement. I'm not going to lie. That's pussy, though. Like, I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't really for that either, actually. Maybe next. <laughs> maybe in the next life. You still finish the job, man. to take another step closer to the princess. You probably won't make it out of here alive. But you can still make sure that she won't make it out of here. Either. Come on. Let's get dug on it, bitch. Excuse me? What's this about not making it out of here alive? Do you think this is what I wanted to happen? I have a duty to state the facts of the situation, and honestly, it's a miracle anyone in this room is still standing right now. Don't act so surprised. She's not a normal human being, but she can't die, I feel like. Can you not feel all those gashes and holes pulling you apart? If the princess doesn't do you in here, blood loss is certain to finish the job. I'm already knowing I was gonna die, though. You take another step forward. And the princess will just duke you. it out then on some duck ski. The two of you enter one last exchange, a flurry of blade and claw and fleshy ribbons. And then you stop. Neither you nor princess able to go any further. We are just lit up and just... You collapse on the ground. And the princess collapses beside you. This Blood is a true love story. You both. Bonnie and Clyde both reverse, fam. Fade away. After all this time alone, I thought I'd finally found a friend, but you were just another monster, weren't you? You know I'm a monster, baby. Come on now. Silence, <laughs> as the room starts to get fuzzy around you. I hate Paul. You've paid a terrible price, but you've saved us all. It's over. If you think this is it, you're sorely mistaken. Get it back One in blood, then, another. bitch. I'll Get it back sure in blood. You pay for this. We've been writing for it. You say this and you say that, but all I hear is chit chat. Come on. But you don't have time to worry over such things. Everything goes dark. Maybe he's not rhyming at this point. <laughs> what? I die? No, I don't, because it's chapter two. You can't fool the fooler. You're on a path in the woods, and at the end of that path, is a cabin. You're yeah. here to slay her. It'll be the end of the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How many times are you going to tell us? But I died. What am I doing here? Wait, this happened already. I'm getting terrible sense of deja vu, but I already slayed the princess. Um, We're going to just go proceed to the cabin. She's going to be oh, double boy. chained up, too. Before you go any further, she will lie. She, she will cheat. Yeah, she, she will was do everything, everything in her power, power to, stop to stop me. Come on. She can't fool Don't me. Believe a word she she says. Says. Come on now. <laughs> Don't worry. You can trust us to get the job done. Let's proceed, bro. Hold on. Ain't voice a skeptic in the second one? I haven't heard the bro of the what cabin is, this is a mirror? mess of twisted roots. The walls a chaotic weave of knotted wood that Do I want to look at this mirror again, bro? Because last time it messed me up looking at this mirror. The floor is damp and earthy. I'm not, I don't think I'm going to do it this is a slab I'm not of looking at this mirror. Of a shelf with a pristine blade perched on its edge. Dang, why you get so in detail the about the freaking your blade? Implement. You'll need it if you want to do this right. I'm not gonna lie, I'm going down there straight this time. Like, I ain't even doing talking with the bee. Hold on. Take the blade. I'm not going Take anywhere the near the mirror, the bro. It's not in my it peripheral. Would be to slay the princess and save the world without a weapon. Well, if we're grabbing a weapon, we should probably keep it hidden behind our backs. She doesn't have to know we have it. That's, That's not smart. actually a bad idea. W voice of hero. I mean, you ain't even saying. Into the basement, bro. The mirror disappeared, you see? The mirror disappeared. The door to the basement creaks open, revealing a staircase dug into the muddy earth below. The ceiling is thick with roots that hang like locks of tangled hair. The weak starlight from the cabin windows behind you can barely penetrate the gloom here, only illuminating the edges of an opening below. It shines in the darkness like some kind of massive moor waiting to swallow you up into the air smells of dirt and copper 
It's thick and wet. Yo, he's getting as if you're really descriptive about this thing, man. I don't even know what we inside. If you can sure is descriptive about it, though. Be doing her a favor. I'll tell you that much. Her voice skitters up from below. Something nasty finds itself on my stairs. You don't own these stairs, down. bitch. Don't be scared. I probably won't bite. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, what if you do bite? <laughs> what if you do? What if you do? I'm not nasty. <laughs> I'm but not you nasty. Are. You're a wretched little thing. I recognize that voice as easily as I recognized your nervous little footsteps coming up the path. I know who you are, and I remember what you've done. Oh, then do it. Do something about it. Come she on. Must have you confused <laughs> with someone else. And the narrator. I just died, fam. She seems friendly enough. Maybe we can talk our way out of this whole situation. Oh, it's the voice of Optimus this time. Yo, that's clean. I didn't even repeat <sighs> the situation. Can't. Unless you slay her right away, she's going to break free and end the world. Yo, There's my no reasoning for my creepy ass is. chair chat. Oh God! Look, I'm just throwing ideas out there. I like to think out loud. I'm the kind of guy who likes a discussion. Don't we want to hear what everyone has to say before making any big decisions? W. Do you want to hear what everyone has to say, or do you just want to hear yourself talk? Mmm. Voice of the Heroes, keeping it the PG, bro. He keeping it, he keeping it hundred percent gangster, real witch niggas. You need to stop lingering. Your task is to slay the princess, not endlessly debate about what to do with the princess. Fine, fine. You're, You're the, boss. the boss. Come on now. Thank you. Oh, the you even the prison the is different from last time. Entering the dark room below. She on go mode, fam. Oh, I like you it. Come on. You can just make out the shape of the princess in the gloom. She's still bad, She's though. huddled against the far wall. <laughs> I would. Her eyes bright and glaring from amid the thick roots. I accidentally took another screenshot. And there you are. One hand tucked away behind your back, gripping that sharp, sharp blade, no doubt. The Corona Boney. That's not fair. How would she know that? Cause I'm, I'm, <laughs> I killed her before. So we've dropped the pretenses. Good. She's acting like the two of you already know each other. The narrator, you why trying to freaking masturbate the mind? Oh no. That was a, was that You've weird? You've already oh, been oh, here, no. haven't you? That was weird. That's a weird thing to say. That's pretty sharp. How'd you figure that one out? Call it deductive reasoning. Well, you seem to be great at it. Is that goddamn go? Do you remember us then? Do you remember last time? No, I don't. But you and the princess clearly have a shared reality, even if I'm not a part of it. I won't waste time fighting you on something that's clearly true. It is true. I'm just glad we could put all this behind us. I like the voice of Optimus, man. I need him in my real life, bro. Is it all behind us? Just focus on the task at hand. I don't care if you've been here before, and I don't care if you think you'll go somewhere else after this. My world is on the line right now, so I'd appreciate it if you would take this seriously and slay her. Let's okay. chat her up a bit first. Maybe we can find a middle ground. We killed her in the past happy. life. She's on go mode 100%. Don't man. Talk she ain't gonna to talk to You're anything. just going to make things more she difficult wants, than they she have She wants blood, bruh. I ended her life last time. Well... I seem to remember you having a tongue. I can talk. Hold on. I'm sorry about last time. I'm not. Look, I made a huge mistake. We all make mistakes, right? I'm sure you made mistakes. I make you make mistakes. Don't worry. The blade isn't for you, or not for, or not for killing you. We got to get you out somehow, right? That's a W. I get the sense you're not happy with me. W sarcasm. You're scared. You you scared me, okay? When you start gnawing your arm off, it scared me, so I, I stabbed you. Things got out of hand. I'm finna lie my ass off. Watch this. 100% manipulated. Watch this. I'm finna, I'm finna pull it. Things did get out of hand, didn't they? But it's hard to let bygones be bygones when they led to murder. Oh, never mind. Look at her ugly ass toenails, though. What is... What is... What... Harriet? What is she? Nah, this ain't... No. This is not no princess, man. You can't fool me. And you started it. I did start it, though. 
I'm sorry about last time, fam. I should apologize, man up, bro. No Ooh, cap. Smart. Let's apologize. Get us back on the right foot. Dang, I got this blade. I should tell her I got this blade, so somehow oh, to get you Oh, you're up. sorry. Isn't that nice? You're such a gracious little monster. Oh, she did call me a monster, bro. She want me gone. Well, if you're sorry, then let me out of here. Prove it. I dang it, I'm getting manipulated again, bro. But I'm gonna try. I feel like she's not bad, but I don't know what I keep doing. Don't worry, the blade isn't for you. We have to get you somehow, right? Oh, I don't need you to cut me out. Oh. The princess grins as the chains fall from oh, the Oh, I'm dead. Oh, GG's. She could have gotten out of those the whole time. That sneaky little. A woman after my own heart, really. What she knows mean? how to hold her cards close to her chest. This is why she can't just be abandoned here. If left to her own devices, she'll find a way out. Now stop her. I, I guess I, I guess since you're not happy with me. Look, um, we teamed up. She's gonna, oh, I don't wanna charge first though. I wanna wait till she charge me and I play defense, fam. Cause I feel like if I charge her first, she's gonna kill the mess out of me. All right, if you could have gotten out this whole time, what do you even need me for? The cabin isn't locked. So we're at an impasse. Neither of us is gonna get anywhere if we can't trust each if we can't trust each other unless you want to fight, but I don't want to fight. That's a good that's a real that's a real in his answer. That's a real in his answer. I give it to that. Look, I know, I know. Things I messed you last year, but this team up. I suppose you didn't come into my hovel of your own accord, did you? Alright. I suppose I could team up. I need a way out after all. And unfortunately, you're the only one I have. She's finna stab me in the back, bro. Seems to me like she's offering a mutually beneficial arrangement. Vos of, vos of ultimate. It. Hold on, hold my fault. The you punching. The freaking voice of optimism is literally chatting, bro. He's gonna get me killed. He's gonna literally give me back It sounds to me like she's offering an arrangement that benefits her and her alone. I get this since you're not happy with me. Why do I feel like we are at a nagging feeling you're gonna stab me in the back if I help you out of here? No and why cap. would I do such a thing? Is someone's guilty conscience getting to them? But I wouldn't worry. As much as I may hate you, letting you live is in my best interests. If you get me out of here, the only thing that will be dead and buried is the bad blood That's us. so cap, though. I see it in your eyes. You're evil. Oh, that nagging feeling you mentioned is me, by the way. I am actually a little anxious about a potential backstabbing event. W, voice of optimism. He even real. He even knows something suspicious about this B. She needs us to get out of here. We'll be fine if that's what we decide to do. You won't be fine, because destruction is in her nature. If she gets out of here, that's it for the world, remember? Even if that's true, that doesn't automatically mean she's gonna stab us in the back. How is voice of heroes more like lacking than the voice of optimism, bro? I think that depends on your definition of he words like has stab the idea and of in the back. Stab in the back. She bro. might not literally do that, but she could very well symbolically do the same thing. See? Look he at her. It. Harry There's nothing wrong with looking out for number Crazy one. toenails, freaking beefy arms, bro. She finna kill me. Okay. Let's leave. Leave with the princess. I don't want to hurt you, but there's clearly some broken trust. Give her the blade. That would show trust, though, fam. But oh my god, I'm putting myself at a huge risk. I'm not gonna lie. She's gonna stab me in the back regardless. We're just gonna go balls and do it, man. Let's be real. You, you can't be serious. My fault, narrator. That is puss to do. Now, hold on. We should put this to a vote. The blade is one of our See, most See, even a voice of optimism is, is like locked what in. What if she uses it to kill us? I vote no. As do I. I, uh, abstain? You abstain. She's but she's going to kill, kill us regardless, gang. You know that, right? Like, 
Haha, <laughs> yeah, never mind. That was a silly idea. I'm not even finna back out, bro. I have to give it to her. This isn't a democracy. We're giving her the blade. It shows trust. Hopefully, she has decent enough character where she's gonna be like, that's W, that's W character. I like your character. And she's gonna trust me again, bro. I'm trying to offer trust. Please accept my trust. Don't manipulate me. You're going to get everyone killed. You know that, right? <sighs> but of course you do. She's gonna murder me. Die, Toss the blade at the princess's feet. She eyes it with suspicion before kneeling down to pick it up. I wouldn't have done that. Why did you? She creeps oh forward. Oh my god, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. And she I'm scared. I'm scared. What do you think happens now? <sighs> That's up to you. That's why I gave you the. That's why I gave you the blade. I chose. I chose last time, and I regret it. So now it's your time to choose. That's W manipulation, though. That's a great sentence. I like that. We're both scared, and we're both hurting. If one of us doesn't make a change, we're probably, we'll probably kill each other forever. Do you want that? I don't. We'd be better than this. You are beautiful, and I actually want to save you. And this feels like the only way to do it. What in the man? If you're like somebody I know, you're probably going to kill me. I'm gonna I'm gonna get the manipulation choice though. It's up that's up to you. It's why I gave you the blade. I chose last time and I regret it. So now it's your time to choose. Her shoulders tense and her eyes dart away. That's W manipulation, fam. This is another trick. You're trying to sow doubt. But it's not going to work on me. Oh, then she buries the blade in your heart. Never trust these women, fam. I should've known, man. God oh, damn. No. No, come on, that's not right. My fault. I told bro. you. I told you. This is what Brother, she's she is gonna kill me regardless though, gang. Glee dances across her face as you fall to the ground. I did it. I, I got, got you. you. Yeah, you, you did give me. The princess seems to tremble. Her smile fading quickly, replaced with concern. Her nervous I built a friend. I gaze. built a friend. Why? Why did you let me do this? But you don't have strength to respond. Nor do you have the time. I'm Everything dead. goes dark. And you die. And you die. R.I.P. Caitlin, man. On in the next life. <gasps> I made it to chapter three. I didn't permanently die. You're on a path in the woods. She stabbed us. She actually stabbed us. Voice of the cheated. <laughs> of course she stabbed us. We gave her the blade, which I might add, I voted against. But the whole point was that she wasn't supposed to do that. The whole point of giving her the blade was to break the cycle of violence. And she Facts. just she just killed us anyway. Facts. I guess it really doesn't matter if she killed us, though, right? We're back here, which means that everything's fine, or fine adjacent. Maybe she won't be as keen to betray us this time. Facts. We've already proven Hold on, maybe she actually change. trusts us. Maybe that sore little take to show her that there's another way to do things. You know... Maybe you're right. In which w case, voice of I optimism. Give me that, bro. To do is to get Kevin back to the and give it another try. Give what another try exactly? You are aware I've been listening to you, right? Like that changes anything. We all know the game is rigged. It doesn't even matter if she's nice this time. I'm sure he'll find a way to turn us against each That's other. That's a fact. Great. So you've obviously been here before, since you apparently died at least once. Twice, actually. Twice, literally. Sure. Twice. This is a W love story. I'm already I'll seeing the vision. I'll you the little introduction I had planned. You already know about the princess, and clearly you already know that she's dangerous. So don't muck this up. It's bad enough that this isn't your first time through. Shut up. Don't mock me, gang. This place is different. It keeps changing. I don't want to tell him that. We're going to free her. I'm, I don't want to tell him that either. We're even now. I'm sure she understands that, but we'll see what she has to say for herself when we get to the cabin. That's a spit. I'll tell yes. him that. Good. Playing both sides. That's what smart people do, and you're the smartest in the room. I know. That's that 150 IQ. Thank you. I'm Somebody recognized it. I'm not sure it counts it. as playing both sides if people can hear you doing it. 
Buddy, you're thinking in far too few dimensions. There's layers to doing this right, and I'm pretty sure the one making the choices gets that. Trust I do get it. The plan. I do get it. Trust in what plan? The decider's plan. Sure, we don't know what the plan is yet, but that's part of the whole trusting thing, isn't it? A good leader knows how and when to keep things secret. And sometimes a good leader even knows to keep things secret from himself. himself. Come on. Sure. We'll see what she has to say I don't for know what he is but Don't forget about. that whatever she says is likely just as much lies as what he's been telling us. We should keep our cards close to our chest. If I were you, I'd remember what she's done. You know how dangerous she is. And you should know that someone like her shouldn't be let loose upon the world. That's a spit. This, this place is different. I don't want to keep telling that. No matter what happens next, it all seems like our answer are in the cabin. Let's proceed to the cabin, bro. It isn't long before you find yourself at the base of the cabin. I think it's clear where everyone stands at this point. It is. I don't know if I'd say everyone. No, I'm pretty sure everybody cool. You talking about me? I have a position. It's a good one, too. Is that voice of reason? Ignore him, he's just talking for talking's sake. My position is the only one that matters. The princess is a threat to you. She's a threat to me, and most importantly, she's a threat to the world. You know what you have to do. Fam, do I really know what I have to do? But come on. I'm not taking a weapon this time. The interior time of the oh. cabin is hardly an interior at all anymore. Do I take a flower there? Burned out ruins merely suggest the shape of the structure that once stood here. Charred wood still reeking of ash but beneath it lies the fresh smell of spring growth after rain, the promise of new life in the wreckage I'm of the I'm bring old. her a flower, bro. The only furniture of note is the crisp shell of what was once a table, a pristine... Wait, this isn't right. This is supposed to be a pristine blade. Why isn't there a pristine blade? There's not even a knife. We, we gave it to her last time. She can't still have it, can she? Well, it's not here. And if she has it, let me guess, you want to get all chummy with her. I think that's our best option. What do you mean? Look, as far as I see it, if it's between him and her, I say we side with the one who has the weapon. It's just the smart thing to do. Literally, talk to these nibbers, voice of Optimus. I wouldn't be so hasty. I'm sure the blade will turn up somewhere. She can't have it. That's not how this is supposed to work. Of course we don't get to make yeah, a choice bring her a flower, bro. Every single time we come back here, something has to be different. And I'm still... Y'all not finna trick me with the mirror. I'm still not going to the mirror. Yeah. Why didn't you mention the mirror? No, I talked about the mirror! I'm so... Oh my god, I'm special needs, bro. I didn't mention the mirror because there isn't a mirror. But he says there isn't one. That's got to count for something, right? Yeah, it counts for something. He's either a liar or he doesn't hold all the cards. But I think we already knew it had to be one of those. So is the door to the basement behind the mirror? I promise you there isn't a mirror and there isn't a door to the basement. The entrance is more of a burned out frame than anything else. And it's right there Brother, on the far side of the room. I did not mean to talk about Do the mirror, bro. What do you mean approach the mirror is my only option? I'm dead here, bro. You step forward and approach the scorched entryway leading to the basement, hesitating before you begin the descent. Might as well take a look while we can. There's nothing else to do here now that the knife has been taken from us. You reach forward and wave your hand through the hollow entrance leading to the basement. You really thought there was a mirror there, didn't you? That figures. I did think there was a mirror. Well, then. seems like the only way to go is forward, isn't it? Yes, that's where everything tends to be. Let's just put on a good face and have our wits about us. Enter that basement, boy. You step through the frame of scorched wood and make your way into the darkness below. The stairs oh. to the basement are covered in a fine layer of gritty ash. The air still feels warm, as if the fires that ruined this place had only recently been extinguished yet fresh shoots of thorny branches are already weaving themselves through the soot-covered earth of the walls around you. Their spines point courteously down this towards place the basement, every time so you're able really. to brush past their jagged points with ease. 
at least on the Does way Does that mean something? But you don't need to think about the way back up just yet. That's a matter for after the world's been saved. I'd say this feels like a trap, but you practically said as much. They're only thorns. I'd say getting a few scratches in exchange for the lives of everyone in existence is a fair trade. I don't still don't trust the narrator either, bro. Her voice, worn down by pain and suspicion, hobbles up the stairs. I can't get away from you, can I? We kill each other and you come back. You let me kill you and you come back. I don't know why you let me do that. I don't know what you want from me. Hold on, she seems kind of cool. Hold on. No, no, no. She's talking to me like a human being. I'm gonna lock in. I want you to figure out a way for good. Yes. I think you know w. how this goes. I'm down here and I can't leave. So come down and talk. It's not like I can stop you. Come on. Please don't kill me, fam. Continue down the basement stairs. I showed trust. We're building the connection. The edges of you gonna get. You gonna more let me. As you make your way forward. You step out into what no. was once a vast open cavern. Now and she has the blade by too. Briars and prickles and thistles. The at the heart of it all, encased in a tight weave of vines, is the princess. Her bloody, trembling hands clutching a pristine blade. Did you know this was going to happen to me? Are you here to watch me suffer? Are you here to laugh? What do you mean am I here to laugh? I gave you, you killed me last time. I want to be here to laugh, fam. At this point, I'm here to get you out, bro. You got to build that connection somehow, man. Yeah, I'm here to laugh. What did you think would happen after you would kill me? I'm not here to laugh. I'm here to free you if you'll let me. That's a W. That's a W manipulative choice. If you let me. I like that ending. I can cut you free, but you have to give me the blade. Reach for the blade. You're in prison. Of your own making, I broke our cycle of violence. If you still want to wallow in it, be my guest. Turn and leave. That's a, like, sassy-ass answer, though. Um, if you let me. I... I want to trust you. Then trust me, bro. Come on. Her grip tightens on the blade. But you're hiding something, aren't you? Why would you help me if you weren't helping yourself? I can tell you what I'm hiding. You're not the only one who earns for freedom. I'm trapped as you are. I think we need to leave together. That's a W choice because my character is trapped in a cycle. I keep repeating the damn cycle with the narrator trying to get me to kill him. Is there nothing I can say to change your mind? Reach for the blade is too much. No, I'm not leaving. I think I'm going to go with this one. The princess clutches the blade closer to her chest. Please. That sounds nice. I'm so tired of the bad blood between She's us. She's manipulating me again. Go. I feel it. Me. I feel it. She's manipulating me. I'm still going to die to this bee. Oh, my God. Her eyes dart away from yours for a brief moment. She ain't fooling nobody with these eyes, man. But she is. And I've also though. hurt you. Is there nothing I can say to change your mind? Can I take the blade now? Reach for the blade. Uh, fine. If you're going to be like that, <laughs> I don't. I don't want to turn it. Damn. Excuse me, chat. I don't want to turn it. Leave. Is there nothing I can say to change your mind? You might as well. I. I don't know. What can either of us really say at this point? How can we trust something as hollow as words? Just stab each other, and call it like a blood cycle truce. She's right. There's nothing left to say. So let's get a move on and do something before she comes up with a scheme to get out of here on her own. Careful like with that him. one. He's not the smooth negotiator he thinks he is. <laughs> it does feel like we're stuck until we do something. If there's even anything to do besides make things worse. Dang. We're not making things worse. I think she wants to trust us. She does want us to trust us. Then maybe it's past time for us to all... Anything counts as action. Can I take the blade now? I don't want to. Okay. I don't have anything. I don't want to leave. That's that's weird. Okay. Then maybe it's time. Maybe it's past time for either of us to say anything. All that counts is action. Oh, my God. What should I ask? I want to ask, though, bro. I feel like asking is more respectful. I should ask, fam. Can I take the blade now? Reach for the blade is crazy. I'm going to say this. You reach please, towards please. her bloodied hands. 
laying your palm on her trembling fingers. I'm not gonna kill you, bro. Please. For a moment, she clutches it even tighter, her knuckles going white Please. with the effort. Please, come on. This is a love story. It's me and you today. The tension fades. Her grip finally loosens and she Thank allows you. you to take the weapon. Thank you. You carefully pull it free from the thorns that they scrape at your skin, leaving red trickles of fresh blood all along your arms. God. Oh my, hold on. Hold on. The narrator, you were covering this up? Am I saying this? Oh, my fault. We're not here to get horny. We're here to save the princess. We damned. She really gave it to us. It feels like it's been so long since we've held real power in our hands. I wonder what we should do with it. I'm not gonna lie, first thing we gotta do is, out of respect, cut her out of these vines. Obviously. Literally, obviously. It's the right thing to do. I think you're right. She's as much a victim in all of this as we've been. Besides, it would really stick it to him to free her. No cap. Or, hear me out. We slay her. Right here, right now. She's no! Never been so helpless. And if the voice of Optimus of is that, evil! We'll this is crazy! But he is right, though. Like, if I was on demon timing, bro, he's 100% right. She's at probably her most vulnerable state right now. Then you can just easy yep, slice the neck and dead. GG's. That sounds like a splendid idea. You should listen to him. But We've all said our lie. piece. Now it's time to make our move. I came this far, finally got her to trust me. It's two against one. I'm not gonna kill her. It's two against two. You don't count. No, he do count. Uh, and why shouldn't he count? Because he's clearly not one of us. That doesn't matter. He's been with us the whole time. He should get a say. Thank you. So, did you mean it? Or was I a fool to hand my life to you? No, I'm not gonna kill you this time, man. Even though they want me to. Cut her free. Yes. What a good idea. Let's cut her free. What? No. Hey, hello. What's up, man? Welcome to the stream. Oh, so you're suddenly team free her. You can't just switch sides as soon as we make a decision. I can do whatever I want, and I believe with my whole heart that this is the right course. Even if he'll stick a knife in our back as soon as he has the opportunity, it's still better to have him nominally on our side. At least that gets him to shut up for a while. That's a fact. See? We're all friends here. United in our actions like and intentions. I like his little outfit she got going on, though. Yeah, united. But the other one has a point. If it keeps you quiet, sure. We're all friends. Take the blade to the thorny vines imprisoning the princess and she flinches, relaxing only slightly as the blade slices into the thick vegetation rather than Oh my arm. gosh, she actually trusts me, bro. W. And she flinches again as the last Thank of the you, vines Princess. Is cut away I'm actually gonna save her now, bro. She trusts all that, me. She's still expecting you to turn on her and stab her in the heart. But you're not going to do that, are you? I'm not. Still, all it would take. But she is at her blade. most vulnerable part. Like, I'm not going to lie. She's at her most vulnerable state right now. She actually trusts me. Is that now. really all you've got? Threatening us with an accidental misstep? I expected more from you. Our blade didn't even waver when he said that. Yeah, you're right. He's a bit of a nobody, isn't he? Literally. I've been on your side of all this since the beginning. The princess out falls into your arms. Tears oh streaking down her cheeks. I can't please, believe you're making please me describe don't kill this. Me. I hate you. You actually meant it. You rescued me. Yes, ma'am. Of course I did. I really hate the people who put us here. That's a good choice. Or, of course I did. Dang! I feel like of course I did is good too, fam. What are we feeling, bro? Of course I did. Or I really hate the people who put us here. Me too. I bet that's real. She smiles, her hand slipping into yours, and the two of you rush to the basement stairs. Shameful, really, that the same thorns that so graciously allowed you downstairs are now blocking your only way out. You're getting desperate, aren't you? Even more proof that you can't actually do anything to stop us. 
I'm not even sure we need to do any cutting. We can just move them out of the way. What a pathetic showing, really. Oh, God, let's just move them out the way. A few pointy sticks can't keep us down here. We're both meant for so much more than this. Thank you, but please don't turn into that whatever freaky thing you turned into, bro. Step into the thorns. I'm trusting it. As you step into the thorns covering the basement stairs, they yield. The narrator poked out. The ascend the stairs without obstacle. This is unacceptable. The second you step out of this cabin with her, the world ends. Do you hear me? Let me see what the world end there, man. So good to hear you say that. That you're admitting you've lost and we've bested you at your own game at last. I don't care what happens. I swear now. to God, if she kills me That's again, I'm gonna I actually be so pissed, bro. You and the princess hesitate at the cabin door. This is your last chance. Look at the eyes. She's gonna manipulate me. I'm dying again. I'm already knowing I am. GG's, Caitlin. We've already made our decision. GG's, fam. We're finally leaving here together, aren't we? And all we had to do was trust each other. It wasn't easy, but I'm glad we finally I'm could. dying. No, I don't trust your voice, bro. Step into your freedom. I'm for the opening door. She's going to kill me. Clasped Work through some issues and learn to trust again. And step out into a new day, you irredeemable murderers. You irredeemable murderers is crazy to say to somebody, bro. Bro, when I stand. Where's everything going? No, I'm finna die again. Why is it so cold? GG's. Oh, yep. What even is that? Like, what is happening? You do not have an opportunity to respond. Something has taken her away. It's left something in her place. She's gone. Where does she They're go? gonna kill me again, Should bro. Should we try and find her? I'm gonna kill whatever this manipulated thing is What's every that? time, fam. Why is it here? Why now? The narrator is gone. I'm, I'm straight approaching the mirror. Do this. Maybe we shouldn't approach it. It's different now. It feels. I don't know. Final. Yeah, it's going Gigi, to do yeah. something to us. I can feel it. If they think die, it's bad. Bro. I'm with them. No, I'm with them too, bro. And we have no other choice. GG's, fam. This, this doesn't feel right. It feels different. Final. It's going to do something to us. Oh, You've been cheated again. I'm with them. Where's your small distance approach you? Raise it to your reflection. How do I keep managing to get the same ending, bro? And I'm a demon. Maybe I should kill that. Man, that whore is dying. I ain't, I ain't getting manipulated no more, bro. I'm tired of her. She keep doing the same thing. Look at her. She's gonna murder me. I don't even have a chance. Something finds me in the long quiet and brings me the gift of a fragile vessel. GG's, what even are you? Do you know the narrator? Are you the one who sent me to slay the princess? Let her out of there. Is this the end of the world? Yes, brother, this is. I'm sorry. There are some changes that can never be undone. There are some tears that can never be unshed. This is not a place that can hold a fragment of a concept. The moment she the arrived, moment there, she she arrived to here, to me. she was going to return to me. Oh my god. I promise that it doesn't hurt. You cap. Is this the end of the world? Yes, it quite is. Do you know about the beyond world? What am I asking that for? But I'm going to ask it to. I know only that they are. Attack the entity, destroy your body is crazy. You cut across the entity in front of you, but nothing happens. What do you My mean? My roots burrow in an ocean beyond your sight. We cannot harm each other as we are now. That's so cap. 
I'm dead, bro. You raised your real to end your life, but it buries you into your space body, showing you nothing at all. As one of many is in front of you, he reaches your forehead and finally touches you on the side of your face. There's nowhere for you to be but here. I'm dead, bro. I keep getting a bad ending. Are you what trapped me here? Are you the one who sent me to print? I'm gonna ask questions. I bro. have only just now stirred to consciousness. <laughs> I could not have trapped you here. And I too yearn to be free. Ah, bro, you want to kill me? I'm not asking these dumb questions. She's not the princess no more. Do we know each other? You are familiar, but you are not me. I feel sadness, longing, hope as I witness you. Why you got hope? Dang, it's looking like it's gonna be GG's, fam. I don't, I'm running out of questions to ask. She is part of me, and part of me is her. Don't get to asking riddles, bitch. I ain't asking all that. But you are always the princess, or are you make, just making yourself a part of her? You speak in circles. Does it matter where one thing begins and another mm. ends? Actually, it does. Do you know the narrator? You are the only thing I have ever known. What the hell? The space we're in is vacant. Nothing comes here but us. So the narrator get the duck out with no consequence? Uh, the gift of a fragile vessel. Yes. Nerves and fibers to feel the worlds beyond. Man, my fault, bro. Probably kicking my to ass, make bro. my own. This one yearns for connection she feels she doesn't deserve. Even when shown compassion, she hid herself away. She will make for a cautious heart. Do not mourn her. She isn't alone anymore. W, I guess. But I'm still gonna mourn her. You just killed somebody. Like, what even are you? I am solitary lights in an empty city. What are you? Um, what do you think I am? I don't know what I am. Thoughts without connections. A dim and nascent network. I'm gonna get as much information I as I am as I can since I'm finna die already, bro. What do you think I am? I think that you are like me. What does that we mean? We are oceans reduced to shallow creeks. Dang, I did just try to destroy my body too and it didn't work. Dang, bro. How can the world have ended if we are talking? I'm asking all the questions, bro, because I know I don't want to die. Nothing as we are, but I know that there are worlds beyond us and that we are meant to reach She's them. She's a cow. Brother, GG's, fam. Brother is not. It's that mirror, bro. I have to do something before the mirror gets to me. That's the, that's, the, that's the only option. There is no exit, but this vessel is a creature of perception. She can make you forget, if only you believe her to be able to. Don't see her in line. Bring perspectives, so that I may be whole. And perhaps then we will know our freedom. Aren't you going to find a way that I can... Wait, aren't you scared that I'll find a way to kill you? How much will I forget? How many more pieces of you do I have to find? What if I don't let you do this to me? <laughs> Facts. Like, what if I just physically just stop you? Okay, make me forget. No, nah, don't make me forget. We're asking questions. Aren't you scared I'll find a way to kill you? I have not lived. I am not afraid to die. 
That's a real ass spill. She just spilled on my dumb ass. How much will I forget? How many more pieces of you do I have to find? I'm asking all the more questions. More than you have found, but less than there are to find. I am infinite. The rest will find their own way home. What are you chatting about? That's literally a chat. She didn't say nothing important, bro. And what if I don't let you do this to me? <laughs> literally. Then we will be here forever, as we are now. Unfinished. Dry. Hollow. I'm not letting you kill me then, bro. We're gonna be here forever. I'm not gonna... I'm not going back, literally. How much will I forget? I'm gonna ask that question. Everything. Until we meet again. Yeah, I'm, I'm just not going to bed. If you need time, then I'll wait with you. Bet, we're going to wait for her forever. I'm petty. You are as I am now. And forever is a long time to remain undone. I'm staying. I am not you. But I know that I would return before forever was finished. What textures will you weave for yourself to occupy forever? Will you place the images of you and I into no. a box for I'm actually getting keeping? like freaked out. What is happening? What are you yapping if about? If you close that box, will you become another you in another world? An imaginary pattern repeating itself until it can no longer bear yeah, the weight man. of its hand so I need cage. a girl, fam. That's all that's telling me. This is all that... that dang! This is what that all telling me, bro. That's all what it You'll leads up to. You'll always come back to the box. Because you'll always want to know what it means to be you. I will be here waiting by your side until you're ready to return to mine. What do you mean? Yo. She crashed my game. Cup, skinny fuck, mixing up the turpies got me lifted up. Quick combust, you better pack your bags before you sit with us.